All right, so what is DNS? DNS stands for a domain name system, and it's integral for any form of computer system, specifically if we're talking about computers and servers, to be able to translate a domain name into an IP address and vice versa. This is almost like central to the internet. All right, so when you go to an internet website and you're typing in www.google.com and you type in enter, behind the actual domain name that you're seeing there, there's actually an IP address which points at the same location. Same way that it works out on the internet, works within your environment. So you set up a DNS server, or at least on a domain controller, you'd have a DNS service installed, and this now manages all of these translations between a domain name, which is more like a human readable, it's something very easy for people to remember, people to understand, and that translates that into an IP address, which generally people don't remember. Some people remember lots of IP addresses, but for the most part, just knowing the domain name is the best thing, and then you let the DNS server do all the translating for you. When you open up a web browser, when you open up a command prompt, when you try to log into a server, or even do some file sharing, you wanna access another server where there's some files stored, all of that will check DNS. It'll check some sort of a DNS register on your network. Generally, as I said, hosted on some sort of a domain controller. It'll then go, ah, okay, my server name, ABC server 01, actually points to this IP address and it goes, goes and connects to that IP address. You can also go and type in the IP address if you remember that, but how much easier is it to just remember the names of servers, the names of devices, the names of websites, you have a big catalog, essentially like a big phone book of all of these records. But that is an, a brief overview around what DNS is. Hey, so small little plug. DNS, we gave you the basics in this video. If you wanna learn more, I've got a full length training course detailing not only a lot more about DNS, we talk about the DNS records, but we also show you how to build your own DNS server on Windows Server. Excellent course check out the show notes, the description below. I've got a link to it. Clicking on that link, you actually get it a lot cheaper than others who go in different ways. So if you wanna know more, check that video out right there. And I love that you stopped by and watched this video, but please do remember to also subscribe, clicking on the button and on the bell, so you don't miss out on any of my future video releases. Thanks so much for spending the time. We'll talk to you next time.